The folks at icstation.com have sent me this little module to test out. Now what this module is, is it's a digital clock, digital thermometer, and a digital voltmeter all in one small convenient package. Perfect for, say, monitoring the temperature of your CPU case. Let's take a look at the operation. Okay, I received this little module today to evaluate. This one came from IC Station. Let's just take a look at what this one is. This one looks to be a clock module. Self-contained clock module. Positive and negative leads. Let's uh, take a look at how this little one works. It's got a battery in it for backup. Looks like it's even got a temperature sensor on it. Four digit display. I think I got a little header that'll plug into this. There we go. Now I can hook it up to the other end of the, this cable here and apply power. Okay. Click it. Okay, we're in minute setting mode now. So minute setting mode first. Click the button and now it's hour setting mode. So I'll take it to 1753. Next click is the day. So this is the 10th. Next click is the month. And the next click is, I don't know what AC means, but it can be set to, looks like zero, one, two, three. This is probably, this is probably for the temperature compensation, I'm thinking, because it has a thermometer on here too. So that's to add a degree and subtract a degree, up to five degrees. And then AD, one, two, three, I don't know what that does. We'll figure that out in a minute, but no instructions came with this thing, so we're kind of on our own. DD. We'll just see what that does. Now when it's displaying the time, if I press the button on the right, it displays the date. I press the button on the right again. Ah, there's the temperature, you see. And if I touch this little sensor on the back, and it's it's pretty warm out today, so it, it probably is that temperature in the shop. Because it's a lot hotter in here than it is outside, and then press the right button again. And I don't know what 5.4U means. That's actually the voltage setting. I'm running it at 5.4 volts. I haven't figured that one out yet, but I'll time. clue in in a minute. Now if we go back into some of these setting modes here, if I, I'll say AC, I'll say AC minus 5 and we'll see what that does, whether that changes down the temperature. Yeah, 28.2, so that's the compensation for the temperature, AC. So if I go back to AC and I change this up to say plus 5, you'll see that it'll add five degrees it'll now say 38.1 so that's your temperature compensation so we'll go back to the AC and we'll take it back to zero uh, AD I don't know what AD does so let's just change that to another setting and just see what it does okay I figured out what this is okay it's it's not just a clock module as I first thought it's clock module it's a temperature module and it's also a voltmeter so right now it's cycling right between time and temperature and that's what the appears that that's what the the setting here does if I press the settings I go through the settings uh, this is the temperature compensation this one here DD let's try taking DD to one let's just see what that does that's time and voltage it's got a voltage meter on it so DD is time and voltage DD1 if I switch it again here um, DD2 DD0 I think it's just whatever it's set to so you can nope 
voltage, time, temperature, and voltage. See the voltage here? If I turn up the voltage, now it's 11.5. So this thing actually will measure voltage coming into it. I don't know what the maximum is. I couldn't find any, any specs on this thing, but my little power supply goes up to 12 volts here and it's measuring 11.7, the same as the display here. So this is going to measure voltage as well as tell you the time and measure the temperature. Now if I go back in here and, and change this here setting again and let's see what DD1 does. DD1 switches between the time and the voltage. Let's see, time and voltage. And DD2 switches between the time and the temperature. And we go to this, I don't know what uh, AD uh, does. Okay, AD, that might be the temperature. That's, okay, temperature, hmm. Let's just see what that does. Because it goes from minus nine to plus nine. If anybody knows what that setting does, AC is obviously, that's the temperature compensation. AD, I don't know what that one uh, changes but it, it can swing from minus 9 all the way through to plus 9 so, but I don't know what that particular one compensates for whether it's factoring in the timing like it changes the timing of the of the oscillator to, to compensate for if the clock is going fast or slow I don't know I couldn't find any documentation on this at all and I went to the website and I, I found nothing on this little module but if anybody knows what one of this S, well, this I guess this is just the number of the of the display. But if anybody knows what that does, it'd be great to find out. But anyway, if we set this to DD zero, it will now display the time, the voltage, and the temperature. So. One of these would be great for putting inside your computer case, right? If you want to keep track of the temperature and you want to keep track of the voltage from one of your power supplies, this will tell you the voltage coming off your power supply. It'll tell you the temperature inside the case, and it'll tell you the time. A neat little package. Again, if you wanted to have external temperature, you could just clip that little thermistor off and mount it external it'll tell you the temperature it only shows 24 hour time as far as I can tell and it only shows the temperature in Celsius so our friends to the south in the United States probably wouldn't find this much use because well they're on the other system they're on Fahrenheit still in 12 hour time the rest of the world though we understand 24 hour time so for the rest of the world, we don't mind it in 24 hour time and we don't mind our temperature in Celsius because that's the way we operate. And if you press the right button, you can turn off the cycling so you can have it. So it just displays the time and nothing but the time. Press the right button once, it'll display the date and it will stay on the date press it again it will display the temperature and it will just display the temperature press it again it will display the voltage and it will stay on the voltage and then press the right button one more time and then it will then cycle between either the time and date or time and temperature or time and voltage or all three depending on the settings of DD whether it's set to DD0, DD1 or DD2 that's it. Um, pretty simple little device. Hope you enjoyed this video. Um, you can pick one of these things up through IC Station. Their logo's on the screen, or it was, and I'll put a link to uh, 
this, although when I did search for it, it wasn't found, so they may be out of stock at the moment. But uh, anyway, there it is. That's a quick look at this little uh, time, temperature, and voltage meter from icstation.com.